Developing now a threat to South Florida's shoreline. A giant blob of seaweed, one of the biggest on record, is headed our way just in time for spring break and the busy summer months. In Local 10, Sanella Sabovic is live now with the threat to our pristine beaches right now. Sanella. Well, already in the ocean, there is this abnormal, massive amount of seaweed or sargassum, as it is known, about 5,000 miles wide. And take a look. We've already seen seaweed on our beaches earlier than normal this year, and scientists say we can expect more. It's unsightly, it smells, and it's washing up on our beaches in great amounts. This thick, bushy seaweed known as sargassum is coming in earlier than usual, and this year's bloom is massive. Satellite imagery shows that it is about 5,000 miles wide. I got some photos from some colleagues in Key West showing a lot of sargassum coming into Smathers Beach in Key West. And this is very early. That was March 5th. Dr. Brian LaPointe, a research professor at FAU, says that it could add to what we already have on our shoreline. Sky 10 captured some seaweed over Hallover Beach in Sunny Isles, Hollywood Beach, and on Fort Lauderdale Beach. And that is moving westward towards the Caribbean region and will be making its way to the Gulf of Mexico and South Florida in the coming months. So more is coming. It's been a decade long problem. There was a big uptick in 2014, 2019, and it looks like this year could be the largest sargassum bloom recorded. If the massive amount does make it to our beaches, it can have serious environmental impacts. It can form dead zones as it comes ashore and rots. And it basically sucks the oxygen out of the water. And when you see that happen, you can, you can smell it. For now, there's no need to sound the alarm as it does depend on the currents and wind. So here in Fort Lauderdale, city officials tell me that this year, compared to the same time last year, they've seen an uptick in sargassum and have collected double the amount. They tell me that they have crews here every morning collecting it from the beach. That is the latest here out of Fort Lauderdale. Sanella Sabovic, Local 10 News. Okay, Sanella, thank you.